A timeline is something that video editors use to build their projects. So you start with files within your media browser up in the top left, and then to add them to your project, you will drag them down into your timeline. You can see our timeline is made up by default into three different tracks or layers. You have text, video, and audio. Now text and video are both considered video tracks, which means anything visual can go on them, whether it's video, text, or images. Audio has to be an audio file only. So to add to your timeline, you simply drag a clip from your browser down into your timeline and then drop it on whichever track you want it to be on. This works like any layering program. Whatever is on top is going to be the most visible and whatever is on the bottom is going to be underneath. So for example, if I drop that into there and then I drop this clip onto this upper layer, I'm only going to see that top layer unless I do something like cropping this or changing the opacity to make the other clip visible underneath. So just be aware that whatever is on your top layer is always going to be the most visible. You can always move things around once you've dropped them into your timeline. Just be aware that you can't move a video track into an audio layer. Those are reserved for audio files. Likewise, I can't put an audio file into a video track. It can only go into an audio track. So building a timeline is as easy as dragging and dropping your files from your browser into your timeline.